Hello and welcome to this demonstration of IBM ViaVoice Embedded Speech Recognition Technology. What I'm about to show you is not a product. It's rather a technology demonstration. In looking for a way to demonstrate the potentials of IBM ViaVoice Embedded Speech Recognition, our developers at Watson Research Center decided to take an IBM WorkPad and extend it using voice technology. Let me give you an example. Speech Suite. Now, I know I need to meet a friend of mine, Ed Smith, but I've forgotten what his address is. Address book. Find Smith. Ed Smith. 555-6355. Now, what if the person I was looking up was a Wojciechowicz? or Yanovich. Well, when I synchronize my WorkPad or Palm Pilot to my desktop, Via Voice could dynamically build a vocabulary so that my Palm Pilot WorkPad would be able to understand those words. Now, I know that if I go to see Ed Smith, I need to stop by the credit union. So, let me take a look. Find credit union. Could not find any union. Well, that's right. My WorkPad couldn't find any credit union because it's a private record. By using voice technology and security technology, I can implement private records, please. You must be verified in order to use that command. Verify me. Password, please. Rosebud. Verification complete. Private records, please. OK. Find credit union. Credit union. 512-555-3176. What is the address? 178 Michigan Avenue, Chicago, Illinois 33431. Now, that's just one example of using voice technology for security. Simple password protection. But in the future, IBM Voice Systems will bring you speaker verification and speaker authentication. Now, I know that I need to stop by the credit union. I know the address. Do I have the time? When is my next appointment? 3 p.m. Meeting with reporters. Now, notice that I checked my appointment, but I was still in my address book. With voice technology, we supersede the old paradigms of a hierarchical user interface. Now we go directly where we want to go. We call it FastPath. Date book. Tomorrow. Tuesday, August 29th. 2 p.m. Meeting. Telephone conference. Begin dictation. Press the microphone button to begin recording. This is a meeting with Ed to discuss proposal changes. List appointments. 2 p.m. Meeting telecon. This is a meeting with Ed to discuss proposal changes. The last appointment has been read. Now that was a simple voice annotation, but we've also built in the ability to dictate information into the device, hot sync it to my desktop PC, and let Via Voice Desktop transcribe that into text. And in the future, when this device is wireless capable, we'll be ready both on the device and on the server. What I've shown you thus far is extending existing applications with voice technology, but voice technology opens up a realm of new application potentials. Let me give you an example. Translator. Japanese. Translating to Japanese. Do you speak English? Can you show me where I am on the map? Spanish. Translating to Spanish. I'd like a single room. Quisiera un cuarto sencillo, por favor. May I have the bill? Puedo tener la cuenta, por favor? Speech suite. Power off. Power off. Now I think you'll agree that's an exciting demonstration of speech recognition technology. Well, how did we do it? Well, in this case, we took a coprocessor, added some memory, a real-time operating system, and then we installed IBM's embedded speech recognition engine. We connected into the serial port of this work pad and we drove its existing applications using voice. Well, why did we do it? 
to demonstrate the potentials of speech recognition technology. We at IBM Voice Systems create end-to-end -end solutions with voice recognition technology from the handheld device to the desktop to server-based systems. If you have a device or an application and you're interested in enabling it with voice recognition technology, please give us a call or visit our website at www.ibm.com slash via voice.